the spirit of the Lord saying many of us he said are in a transition but they're not transitioning he said you're not making the the transition he said the reason is thing he said these these variants and the pandemic they have them in rolled over he said but even in this new year he said because we are in trans in a transition but many are not transitioning and so that's why we're seeing this thing prolonged he said people is trying to hold on to the very things he's trying to take away or the things that have served its purpose in their lives. He said the old and the new cannot live in the same space. They cannot coexist. He said if you don't release it, you're going to be stuck in the old. If you don't let it go, you're going to be stuck in the old. He said, you must make the transition. You must make the transition, says the spirit of the living God. I hear that so loud and clear. You must make the transition. Or you will be stuck in the old. He said, the, the, the shaking in. This this whole pandemic stuff. He said, I, I desire you. God said, I want your attention. He said, you have You have put your place your attention. Put more emphasis on the things that I have created. And not the creator of the things. You have seeken after the things and you have excluded me. He said, I'm the creator of it all. I am the Lord of it all, says God. He said, for I'm desiring you. He said, I want you. I want your attention. Oh, a lot of distraction. He said, you must make the transition. You must make the transition. Or you're going to be stuck in the old. Father God, right now, I lift up the people before you, oh God. Lord, I, I, I ask you, oh God, oh God, to shift their focus off of the things, off of the created things, and place their focus on the creator of all things. I ask right now, God, and I just bind the spirit of distraction in Amantia. That I pull down the stronghold of distraction. That have many of your people distracted, oh God, in Amantia. Distracted on things of the old. Distracted on things that don't really matter. And causing them not to focus and, and do what's required of them right now. I just bind that strong man of distraction right now in the name of Jesus and I uprooted and cast it out of their lives out of their minds right now in the name of Jesus and I just say Lord just just take control of every thought take charge of every thought that's not like you oh God and drive it out of their minds oh God purify their thoughts oh God let your thoughts be in their minds let it rest in them the mind of Christ a sound mind oh God a key 
kingdom mind in Amasia. Upgrade the mindsets of your people, oh God, that they won't try to hold on to the very things that you're trying to take away, the things that have served its purpose in their lives. Oh God, lift their hands up off it in Amasia. Uh, and let them realize, open their spiritual eyes and let them realize it have served its purpose and they don't need it no more. That you're doing a new thing. In the name of Jesus. Lord, don't let them get stuck in the old. But I pull them out the old right now. And I place them on the new path. That you have set before them in the name of Jesus. Oh, yeah. And I thank you for the upgrade that's taking place now. Oh God, the new wine that's being bestowed upon them right now in the name of Jesus. Let them see that the new look better, God. Let them see that the new feel better, God. Let them see that there's more, oh God, to their life in the new, oh God. Oh, drive them out of the old, God. Help them make the transitions, God. He said, for I'm causing this stuff is not just for nothing. He said, for I have caused it in Amasia to force the people to make the transitions in Amasia out of the old and into the new be a part of the new thing says God in Amasia be a part of the new thing says God in Amakia for I have shut the door of the old thing be a part of the new thing says God in Amakia Amakia he said, many of you have spoiled and been and moved. And he said, you waiting around for everything to be in place. He said, everything will not, is never going to be in place. Every I will never be dotted and every T will never be crossed. He said, now is the time to move. Now is the time to make that transition, says God. He said, it's a window that I have opened. And you must move while this window is open, says God. There's a grace on this window, says God. And you must make the move. He said, many I have told you to do different things. Things in Amasia at the beginning of this year, and you haven't done it yet. He said, You must understand the times we're in. You must understand my timing like never before. I'm just gonna have things open up for a certain time frame. And you must jump in into my timing, says God. Into my Appointed time says God in Amakia. Oh, these ain't opportunities in Amasia. These ain't open doors under Abasia. Open portals and open heavens under the Abasia. He said for a long time under the Abasia. He said, but as this window is open, as this opening is open under the Abasia. He said, you must jump in in Amakia in Abasia. And it's reminding me of that scripture when he said the, he troubled the waters at certain time frame. And those who were sick had to jump in and be healed. He said this stuff is not coming around all the time. If you miss this window, if you miss this door, if you miss this opportunity, says God, if you miss this open window in this grace period, that I have said before your life, he said it's gonna not gonna come around another time. It's gonna be take another like 10 years, another seven years for it to come around again. He said, Don't miss this. Move when I say move. Do what I say do. In the time frame that I say do it. You ain't got to fast on it. You ain't got to pray for it. Now is the time, says God. Now the window.
window is open, says God, and I'm a seer. Now my grace is upon it, says God, and I'm a K. Now my favor is upon it, says God, and I'm a seer. Move, says God, and I'm a Kia. Move, says God, and I'm a seer. Make the transition, says the Spirit of the living God. God bless you all. God bless you all. That's the word of the Lord. God bless you.